HyperX is moving into new waters. This time, HyperX brings us the Alloy FPS Mechanical Gaming Keyboard. Built with a solid steel frame, the keyboard has some decent weight to it and you know it will take a knock or two. Built for gamers, this compact design is ideal for FPS shooters, whilst giving maximum movement of your mouse. You know what I'm talking about CSGO players. The Alloy FPS will be released with Cherry MX Blue to start off with, one of the more commonly used switches in gaming. Later down the track, HyperX hopes to release other switches as well to suit every gamer. The keyboard is compact in size and is only 45cm in length and 3.5cm high. The keyboard is one of the more compact keyboards I have ever owned. As you saw earlier, you're given a textured keys for the ultimate of grippiness, but I didn't notice any difference when using them. They did look pretty darn cool though. The keys are easy to change and a key remover is provided as well, as I can always keep on losing these things. One thing you might have noticed as well is the backlight is your HyperX red colour. All the lighting controls is controlled through the hardware on the keyboard itself. Now, I've actually been using this keyboard for about two weeks now and I've been really enjoying it. Now, I know it's sort of hard to sort of express and say, I've been really enjoying my keyboard, but it's a nice difference to the more compact keyboard that I previously had. Now, it's really nice of HyperX to have a full length keyboard right here, but at the same time, keeping everything nice and compact. It's something you don't see much and many in other keyboard designs. One thing you do get with the HyperX Alloy FPS Mechanical Keyboard is a carrying case as well. Now I for one won't be taking my keyboard to any LAN party soon enough, but if you wanted to, you'd be able to take one with the case seen above. Now also one thing I thought would be recommended hopefully in future updates is the positioning of the cable. As you saw before it sits up just behind here but with my Quickfire CM Storm keyboard you have a bit more of a cable management which I would love to see in this Hyperx keyboard. One other thing as well that you do have is an N key rollover which just allows you all the gaming mode so you don't accidentally press your Windows key. Now when using the keyboard while gaming, it was actually really nice, I mean it's a Cherry MX Blue and if you haven't used one before, I highly recommend you checking one out at your local PC store. Did I forget to mention as well the keyboard does this crazy wave with the LEDs, super awesome. As well you're able to actually charge your phone as well with a back USB port. For $159 Australian, some will argue that this keyboard is very expensive, and others stating that for a mechanical steel frame keyboard, it's pretty cheap. I'll leave it up to you and leave your comments down below on what you think about the Hyperx Alloy FPS keyboard.